the wilderness of Calavera Mountain, a popular tourist spot for many people. Hundreds of hikers come here every year. Many become lost. Some are never found. On this episode of Dual Survival, Sam and David will be taking on the roles of two lost hikers who must find their way out. Cooperation is paramount in a survival situation like this. We need to work together to get out of here. If you don't know what you're doing and when you're going to do it, we're going to die. Hey, look at this. Backpack. Humans leave trash everywhere, so it's almost certain that you're going to find something that you can use if you know how to use it. Let's see what we have in here. An empty water bottle. Could be used for storing water if we find some. ESP. There will be no fooling around in a survival situation. Look at this, a switchblade. Hey man, that might not be school property. Just a comb, stupid sensors. Some deodorant. I don't know what we'd use this for. He needs it. Another comb. I guess they want our hair to look good. And a unicorn hunting license. This may come in handy later. Alright, let's load this all back in here. By the way, where are your shoes? I always forget something. Whatever, let's just get out of here. My training with the Boy Scouts is extensive. Oh, with over three years with them, I know that you need to get your essentials and get out of here fast, or you're gonna die within days or weeks. In my decades of teaching my students the arts of survival, I've learned that you need to take advantage of your surroundings and use your natural resources. Like this berry. It's been used for generations by the indigenous people as a nutritional supplement. Delicious. David has gone out to scout ahead in case there's a water source nearby. This river that you can hear, it obviously has to connect somewhere. We gotta be able to bottle this water. Let's hope Sam, found some. Sam, there's some water over here. There's water? Hey, yeah, get that water bottle out. Let's go. This could mean we survive instead of dying. Always use a moving water source, because if it's yeah. standing still, it could build up bacteria and disease. And that would kill you faster than anything else out here. You get water, you survive. It's good, do you take a swig of that? If we want to get out of here, we didn't need a signaling device. So he's going to go get the food, and I'm going to save our butts. The perfect example right here. Under the rock, Smarties work. Look at this cave. Looks like there's a guy in it. <laughs> 